Hi everyone and welcome to Perima's Kitchen. I am Selina and today I'm making dry vermicelli. It was a firm favorite growing up. My brother and I loved dried vermicelli and I hope you like this recipe too. If you're keen on the sweeter version with condensed milk, which is very rich, that's my Piaso recipe that's already been uploaded. So first I'm just toasting some cinnamon sticks. And I'm adding some ground ilachi. You can actually take out the pods and just leave the ilachi seeds. And if you don't have cardamom pods, you can even use your cardamom powder, your ilachi powder. And you only need about a quarter to a half teaspoon. I actually use both. So we want to toast our cinnamon and my ilachi seeds. That brings out the flavor. Next, I'm adding some butter. Approximately three tablespoons of butter. I wish you could get a whiff of that cinnamon and ilachi. It's so incredible. So don't ever rush that part of toasting your spices. It makes all the difference. Once your butter starts to melt, you can add your vermicelli. So I'm using about 300 grams of vermicelli. And you can adjust to your own liking how rich you'd like it, how sweet you'd like it. So I don't generally break my vermicelli intentionally. It will start to break as you toss them around while trying to brown them up. So what we're looking for is a lovely golden brown color. So keep mixing and once you've reached that color, you then are going to turn your stove off and we're going to add some boiling water. Once you've added your boiling water, you can turn your stove back on and at this time you can add some more ilachi powder like a quarter teaspoon if you wish and you can add some sugar white sugar brown sugar whatever you prefer i added about four to five tablespoons of sugar as well as my cardamom powder mix thoroughly and your vermicelli will soften but it'll also start to dry up I used to love the sticky parts that I used to get stuck to the pan. It was one of my favorite things to eat. And if you like almonds, you can toast some almonds or some coconut like I've done. And top up your vermicelli with some toasted almonds or coconut. And enjoy. All the ingredients used will be found in the drop down description below. Please subscribe. Kindly hit the notification bell so you are notified when a new video is uploaded. Please like and share and your comments are always very welcome. Thank you for all your love and support. I truly appreciate it. Lots of love, Selena.